Yeah, everyone's really excited. Um, I don't think we realized how many games we had away, so it's really nice to be home. We're really excited to have packed fans, um, packed stadium, um, so we're really looking forward to that. So training's been fun, um, very uplifting, just being prepared. We have a lot of games coming in the next 10 days, so it's just keeping energy high and load kind of low. Yeah, I mean, I think it's great that you can come back down twice and pull out a win. Obviously, we were not happy with the way that we played. We thought that we could have done better, we should do better, we will do better. Um, and so that's really what we're looking forward to in building in these next couple of games. Um, but I think all around, Mark's talked about it a lot, it just comes down to heart. Like we want to win, we want to play for the person next to us. And so that's making things a bit easier when maybe we're not piecing things together so much on the pitch. Um, it's that solidarity that we have within the team. Obviously it's hard. Um, our game against Newcastle got postponed. Um, Adelaide was a melee um, with everything that happened in that game as well. And so then we only really had one proper game this month. So it was kind of last month. So it was kind of difficult coming in off of that really long break in December. Um, so we didn't think it would be pretty, um, but it needs to be better than that. Yeah, it's obviously an honor. It's really nice to be nominated for anything. Um, but I do think it's a big reflection of the team. Like, I'm not getting nominated for that if the team's not doing well. Um, to be frank, I think that maybe a lot of people on our team got snubbed with a nomination. I don't think it should have been me or just me. Um, but I think it just goes to show that, you know, even though we're the new kids on the block, like, we're here to play, we're here to stay. Um, and I think it really goes to show, like, how we've been performing this month. Um, and so far this season. So I think there's a lot more nominations to come for a lot of girls on this team and I'm really looking forward to that. Yeah, I mean, I just really wanna do my part. So if I am that much taller than somebody else and can try to get my head on the ball, um, I'm more than happy to do that. So I think it's just offensively, those girls, the forwards, Jess, Hannah, Kali, like they work so hard for us. And so when we have set pieces where maybe I can take a little bit of pressure off of them, I just wanna do my part in that regard. So I think a lot of it um, just comes down to the fact that we practice that, that we're dangerous on that, and we like to capitalize on those opportunities. So that's what we look to do on set pieces, and everybody plays a really important role in that. Like the delivery has to be good. Um, everybody around has to be ready for a rebound. So um, we're hungry and we're eager, and it's a great way for us to score goals. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. I mean, this is what we came here to do, um, us internationals. And it's a bit of a dream, and it's really nice to get to do it with the girls here. Everybody's so nice, so it makes coming to work every day really easy. Um, so that's been nice. Obviously, it's difficult, and there are aspects of it that I probably wasn't as mentally prepared for, but now am. Um, and so I'm really enjoying that, kind of just like the grind of it, it is really nice and um, really refreshing. So it's nice to be back playing games, playing minutes. Obviously, I do feel like there's a lot in my game that I still want to improve and a lot that I feel like by the end of the season I will have accomplished. Um, but that doesn't happen without a great team, a great staff. And so I feel like this is the right place for me to do those things. I mean, it's definitely difficult. Like nobody wants to have that quick of a turnaround between games because you feel like your body can't recover. But um, I do feel like we have the people around us, whether that be teammates or staff, that's kind of preparing us for it mentally. Um, Jess McDonald speaks on that a lot. Like a lot of times it really just comes down to mental, like who wants it more? Um, and I feel like for us, that's what it's going to be, especially on the back end of those games, um, especially when you mix in travel and things like that. So. Um, it's coming, it's inevitable, we're gonna have to play and I think we're just preparing for what that will take. So um, really getting down our game plan is important and if we play like we did in Perth, it's gonna make those three games really difficult. So that's why we're really focusing on what we wanna do on the field to conserve our energy, but still be very impactful. Yeah, I mean, Wellington is good. Like I think that their record does not do them any justice. Um, they are definitely a team that at any moment, if you are not paying attention and you drop off, they will punish you. Um, and so I think it'll be an interesting test for us to see how we do against a team that we've played already. Um, we didn't like our first half against them. We thought we should have played a bit better. Um, obviously, they were very dangerous on set pieces, on corners, so it's about minimizing things like that. So um, we're excited to take the things from that game that we did well and hopefully repeat them, but also learn from it. So I think this will be really good for us in understanding how we learn from people that we've played before um, and how we can capitalize on things maybe we didn't the first time we played them.